Bonjour and we are renew to my YouTube channel Learn French with Shifa. It is day 18 of our lockdown series 21. And today in this video we will be learning about les saisons et les expressions du temps. The seasons and the time expression. The expressions related to weather. Okay, to start with, il y a quatre saisons dans une année. Il y a quatre saisons dans une année. There are, il y a means there are, quatre, four, saisons, seasons, dans une année, in an year. Le premier, le premier, l'été, 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 summer. L'automne, l'automne, l'automne is autumn. L'hiver, L'hiver, winter, and the last fourth one is le printemps. Le printemps means spring. L'été, l'automne, l'hiver, le printemps. Now, what do you see in the bracket? This is how we write in a particular weather. If you see, there is E in written with winter, summers, and autumn. And AU we use for spring. Now how do we say it? We say on été. On été. In summers. On été. Then on automne. On automne. We don't pronounce this M. On automne. Then we have on hiver. On hiver. And last au printemps. Au printemps. Now Further, we will be learning the expressions which are related to the seasons. Now, before we learn these expressions, let's see what these two expressions mean. Now, in the literal translation in English is, he makes or he does. But whenever we use these two words with an adjective, they refer to the weather adjective. And ilia means there is, there are. We say ilia, there is, there are. And now we are going to start with the expression. La première expression. The first expression. Il fait beau. Il fait beau. Now beau is an adjective means handsome. But in weather it is used for referring good. Il fait beau means the weather is good. Il fait beau. Second. Opposite of beau. Mauvais. Mauvais is that word. Mauvais means bad. So, il fait mauvais. Il fait mauvais. Third, show. Show means hot. So, il fait show means the weather is hot. And if we write il fait très show, il fait très show means the weather is very hot. Fourth, il fait froid. Il fait froid. Il fait froid means the weather is cold. Beau, mauvais, chaud, froid. Beau, mauvais, chaud, froid. Il fait means the weather is. And then we have the adjectives to make our sentences in English. Now look at these two words. Vo means wind and brouillard means fog. So instead of saying it is foggy, in French we write Il fait du Vent. The weather is some fog, some wind. So, il fait du vent means it is windy. And il fait du brouillard means it is foggy. Instead of using an adjective, we use the nouns here. Vent is wind and brouillard means fog. So, il fait beau, il fait mauvais, il fait chaud. Il fait froid, il fait du vent, and il fait du brouillard. Now, one, one uh, st sentence that we could use in summer. Il fait très chaud. And in winters, it is very cold. En hiver, en hiver, il fait froid. Il fait froid. Quelques autres expressions sont. Il fait du soleil. Il du soleil. Now soleil means sun. So il fait du soleil means it is sunny. Then we have il fait frais. Il fait frais. Now 
Now phal means fresh. So one could say it is cool. The weather is cool and the weather is fresh. Then we have il pla. Il pla. Il pla means it rains. Il neige. Il neige. Il neige means it snows. Il gel. Il gel. Il gel means it is freezing. And now we have il ya de nuage. Now this word nuage means clouds. So there are some clouds means it is cloudy. Il ya de nuage. It is cloudy. And then these two again. I thought they were important to learn when one is learning the seasons. Il fait jour and il fait nuit. Il fait jour means it is daytime. And il fait nuit means it is night time. So I'm going to repeat it one more time. Écoutez bien et répétez après moi. Listen well and repeat after me. One. Il fait du soleil. Il fait frais. Il pleut. Il neige. Il gèle. Il y a des nuages. Il fait jour and il fait nuit. Now with this we conclude our today's session. I hope that you enjoyed watching my video. Please like and subscribe to my channel Learn French with Shifa. And for any suggestions or uh, query, put it in the comment section and press the bell icon for the latest notification. C'est tout pour aujourd'hui. That is all for today. Merci, au revoir, bonne journée, à demain.